I want to talk about the overreach of the medical system when it comes to claiming that bad genes are the cause of disease. Uh, certainly an overreach. Certainly uh, genes, our genes determine our eye color, hair color, skin color, determine if we're going to be a boy or girl. Tells our liver cells to make liver cells when it's repairing itself. Tells our bone cells to make bone cells when it's repairing the bones. But certainly is not a cause of any disease. Okay? Um, all of these things we call birth defects and almost all of these non-infectious diseases that are uh, considered uh, chronic degenerative diseases, diseases of natural causes, are caused by nutritional deficiencies. I want you to get a hold of the book, Epigenetics, The Death of the Genetic Theory of Transmission, a Amazon bestseller. Very proud of that uh, in the subjects of genetics, epigenetics, and general medicine. Get a hold of the book, Dead Doctors Don't Lie, which says it all. If you have not read the book, Dead Doctors Don't Lie, get the book, Dead Doctors Don't Lie, first, then get epigenetics or get them both at the same time, but read Dead Doctors Don't Lie first. It sets the stage for epigenetics. And then Rare Earths Vin Cures is the first experiments ever done, um, control experiments ever done, were done by me on epigenetics, and they're uh, originally published in Rare Earths Vin Cures. Well, I'm going to talk about cystic fibrosis, muscular dystrophy, sickle cell anemia, Down syndrome, um, elevated blood cholesterol, asthma, these kinds of things. And, uh, you know, one of my big research projects was uh, uh, being a pathologist at the uh, Yerkes Primate Center in Atlanta, Georgia. This is 1977 through 1978. It was kind of a continuum of the Center for the Biology of Natural Systems where I did 20,000 autopsies and 10 million chemistries and 10 million slides of special stains looking for pollution as a cause of disease. Well, that, I had a lot of experience in pathology, and here I am. I'm there for about six months at the Yerkes Primate Center in Atlanta, Georgia, attached to Emory University, and I find the first non-human case of cystic fibrosis was in a monkey. Now, I'm sure it happened before, but nobody paid attention, nobody knew, but I had enough experience to recognize it, did all the um, backtracking because they had saved blood from the mothers and fathers who were not related um, in any way. There were 25 babies all being raised for NASA and uh, found that it was a cystic fibrosis caused by deficiency of a single mineral. You could give the mineral to either animals or people with cystic fibrosis and reverse the disease. Obviously, it's kind of a multifaceted disease. The uh, genetic marker, the positive sweat test, is found in 17 other diseases that, that do not have anything to do with cystic fibrosis. And the connection is they're all deficient in the same nutrient caused by or secondary to a gluten intolerance. So you have to have gluten intolerance. You have to have um, all the symptoms of cystic fibrosis plus a deficiency of this nutrient to get the positive sweat test. Then you have cystic fibrosis. And then muscular dystrophy is a deficiency of pri primarily a mineral. It has been known in animals. Uh, we've el eliminated animals because muscular dystrophy in animals wouldn't make a meat animal worth very much. And so we learned back in the 50s, that this was a deficiency primarily of a single mineral, maybe a little bit of a, another vitamin attached to it, but easily prevented, easily reversed. And sickle cell anemia is a birth defect, nutrients missing in the third to seventh week of pregnancy when the bone marrow mechanisms are forming to form hemoglobin, and you have a birth defect in them because mom is missing stuff, and they form a dysfunctional hemoglobin. Down syndrome is a deficiency of a single mineral in the first duplication after the sperm fertilizes the egg. You're one cell human, you go to two cells. In that duplication from one cell to two cells, if you're missing that mineral, you have a one in 700 chance of um, being a Down syndrome baby. Elevated blood cholesterol, the statin drugs to lower cholesterol, the cholesterol restricted diet gave us erectile dysfunction, it gave us low T, uh, menopausal symptoms at age 30 instead of 60 and 60, uh, 75. Uh, also, adrenal exhaustion, just this exhaustion thing in people in America, and asthma, okay, is caused by deficiency of a single nutrient. And, you know, I've been able to reverse asthma in a week. I've been able to reduce cystic fibrosis, muscular dystrophy. People in wheelchairs with muscular dystrophy in just a couple of months on the program, they're able to get up and run around the room, okay? Sickle cell anemia, we can, we can prevent it 100%. You can have both mother and father with sickle cell anemia and have them have 10 babies, and if you give the mother all 90 cents of nutrients, she'll never have a baby with sickle cell anemia. Now, if it's genetic, all 10 should be sickle cell anemia babies because mom and dad have the disease. But it's not genetic. It's a simple deficiency that causes a birth defect in the bone marrow. Uh, elevated blood cholesterol has nothing to do with anything, okay? Uh, usually um, low blood cholesterol, you know, like 110, 115 without medication. Oh, I've got good genes. No, you have gluten intolerance and you can't absorb cholesterol. And you're going to wind up with Alzheimer's disease. That's the most terrible thing that happened with the statin drugs. They created Alzheimer's disease. Alzheimer's disease is a physician-caused disease by lowering your cholesterol. Again, 
I'd have you get the book Epigenetics, The Death of the Genetic Theory of Disease Transmission, the book Dead Doctors Don't Lie. You've got to read the book Dead Doctors Don't Lie before you read Epigenetics. I didn't want to duplicate anything. Otherwise, the book Epigenetics would be eight inches thick. So I had to just kind of pick up for where Dead Doctors Don't Lie when it uh, dropped off. And then Rare Earths Been Cures with the publication of the first serious documented experiment, a, a um, uh, really a well-done experiment by myself, okay, and you'll just be amazed at what we know about epigenetics back in 1994 when that book, Rare Earths Forbidden Cures, um, Forbidden Cures, was uh, published. Now, and it just really makes you want to cry, the cystic fibrosis, muscular dystrophy, sickle cell anemia are totally preventable diseases. Again, I'm out here screaming about it, and I want you mothers to be to listen uh, before you're pregnant. If you're in the childbearing years, I want you to supplement with all 90 cents of nutrients and read how to do this in epigenetics, the death of the genetic disease transmission, dead doctors don't lie, and rare earth been cures. And we'll be back with dead doctors don't lie after these messages. Okay, Doug, what pearls of wisdom do you have for us? I thought we'd talk a bit about drug companies and their stranglehold on the American people. At Reuters news story headline reads, exclusive makers took big price increases on widely used U.S. drugs. Say uh, these uh, drug companies took hefty uh, increases in the U.S., more than doubling some listed charges for widely used medications. And uh, Reuters did an analysis, and they looked at uh, four of the top uh, nation's top ten drugs, which increased more than 100 percent since 2011. And they found six others that went up at more than 50 percent. The price increases uh, for arthritis, high cholesterol, asthma, and other common uh, drug problems added billions in costs for consumers, employers, and the government health programs. They say uh, extraordinary price hikes by two small companies, Touring Pharmaceuticals and Valiant Pharmaceuticals International Incorporated. Touring uh, expected to book about $200 million by raising the price of Daraprim, an antiparasitic drug uh, for a rare infection, by 5,000%. That comes from company documents that were released by congressional investigators. Uh, sales for these uh, top t- uh, 10 drugs went up 44 percent to 54 million in 2014 from 2011 even though prescriptions for medications dropped 22 percent yeah the prescriptions dropped so they had to raise the prices to keep their profit margin well there you go yeah they go on to say uh the list uh was uh AbV Incorporated, which raised the price of its arthritis drug, Humira, more than 126%. And Amgen Incorporated and a uh, Teva Pharmaceutical Industries, LTD, raised the price uh, treatment for uh, Inbril, a multiple sclerosis drug, and Copaxone, a uh, arthritis. Uh, that's actually the multiple sclerosis drug, and the other one, Inbril, is for arthritis. It raised it to 118%. They say overall spending for drugs rose faster than doctor visits and hospitalization over the past five years. A general drug companies said they had to set the new prices to recoup investments in failed drugs, support new research and development efforts, and pay for clinical trials to broaden the use of approved drugs. Also, they said the medications prevent uh, costly hospitalizations. Companies noted that the analysis of the list prices failed to capture the negotiated discounts and rebates that the uh, drug companies have to give up. But, you know, once again, the same old, same old. These drug companies got all the politicians in their pocket. And, you know, at a time when we were in a down economy a few years ago, uh, they were still posting record profits. Not record, you know, not just that they were making profits. It was record profits in a down economy. And that just goes to show you they don't care about the people. They just care about the bottom line and their, and their investors. We're exactly right there, Doug. And it also shows that the, me- uh, the medical system has got the general public thinking that they cannot exist without the medical system. Oh, you have to be on 10, 12, 15, 20 prescription drugs. Otherwise, you're not going to make it for another year. And so, um, you know, people always ask, well, why do you give 400 lectures a year, Wallach? Why do you live on airplanes and in hotels? Okay, well, that's because somebody's got to do it. And why the good Lord picked me, I have no earthly idea, but I believe he did, because I knew this when I was nine. No nine-year-old figures this out by himself. And, um, you know, Char, she's been with us a long time, 25 years. She's been taking the 90 cents of nutrients um, twice a day for 25 years, never been sick in 25 years. I've been taking them twice a day for, it'll in uh, June, this coming June, it'll be 70 years. I haven't been sick in those 70 years. And um, uh, in June, I'll also be 76. And this is not a genetic thing with either Char or myself. This is, in fact, we're taking the nutrients to support and promote our maximum genetic potential for health and longevity and, and 
fending off disease, speed and strength and intelligence, making good decisions. And uh, these are the sort of things that require 90 essential nutrients, 16 minerals, 16 vitamins, 12 amino acids, 3 fatty acids. Another failed medical theory is that, oh, you just eat well, you get everything you need. You have to supplement, okay? Otherwise, you're going to get these problems, and you're going to wind up paying the piper. And worst of all, they're saying our kids will be the first generation Americans that do not live as long as their parents. If you follow the doctor's guide, that will come true. You must take control here and supplement with all 90 for your kids. Save the kids, you save America. we we'll back. The dead doctors don't lie after these messages. Okay, Doug, let's go to callers. Let's head to Wisconsin. And Amanda, you're on with Dr. Wallach. Hello, Amanda, you're on the air. Hi, um, I'm calling because my dog is dying of kidney failure. We took him to the vet a couple of weeks ago because he wasn't feeling well, and they did an ultrasound and blood work and sent him home to die. And that was pretty much the end of it. He's been going downhill ever since, and I was wondering if there was anything else that we could do. Sure. Okay, uh, how old is the dog? Six. Okay, and does he have diabetes also? No, they rated okay. him perfectly healthy except for kidney failure. Okay, and let's see here. Um, how much does he weigh? He should be 85. Right now he's probably 70. Okay, and let's see here. Um, does he have any other issues? That's well, the, the ultrasound showed that his kidneys were swollen so big that they were pushing on his intestines so he can't go to the bathroom. Which so he's means constipated. He's not growing up. Mm-hmm. Did he ever have skin plums or he itched or scratched or chewed on his toes or anything like that? No. Okay, no. good. All right, let's just assume... No, and he's, this... on a, he's on a mostly raw diet and a higher-end dog food. We got rid of the crap dog food quite some time ago, and he's been on Arthrodex for over a year. Okay, good. All right, so he's on Arthrodex and 70 pounds and... You want uh, three scoops a day because there's one scoop for 25 pounds of body weight. Now, when you have kidney failure, whether a human being or a dog, what is the problem, Char, when you have kidney failure? Do you have kidney failure? What's the problem? The kidneys are fine. It's the uh, a little afferent arteries going into the kidneys that are plugged up from inflammation and stuff. Okay, good. So the kidneys don't work because it can't get the dirty blood to filter. It's not really anything wrong with the kidney most of the time. So let's... um. <clears throat> Uh, so, okay, you have a 70-pound dog here with kidney failure. Vet sent him home to die. What would you do in addition to the Arthrodex and the high-quality dog food? And, uh, make sure there's make sure um, that there's no um, gluten in it, okay? No wheat, barley, rye, or oats. And so what else would you give this dog in addition to the Arthrodex? I would give him the, oh, the Daily Classic and the uh, Niacin Plus and the uh, Cardio Sticks. Very good. Yeah, I'd go ahead and give him two... Uh, the um, daily ultimate classics, okay, two of those twice a day. Just plop them down his throat in the morning, plop them down his throat in the evening. That'll be two bottles a month. And then I would also, as Char says, give him the ultimate um, cardio sticks, um, one a day. I'd give him a half a dose of breakfast and a half a dose of dinner time. Just make it up as you would uh, on the label, and then just give him a half of the dose of breakfast, half a dose of dinner time. And then the ultimate niacin plus, I'd go ahead and give him two of those, one at breakfast, one at dinner time. Again, just plop them down his throat, and uh, it'll take one bottle a month. And then call us. Let us know how the, the, your little friend is doing, because this can do great things for him or her. We'll be back after these messages. Let's head to Cincinnati, Ohio, and Nikki, you're on with Dr. Wallach. Oh, Nikki, you're on the air. Hello, doctor. Uh, I'm calling with regards to my husband, Habib's uh, health condition. He has spoken to you before, Mm -hmm. uh, twice. He is on end-stage kidney disease and with a thyroid issue, and he'll be receiving your products tomorrow. And uh, I have two issues that I'm hoping to get clarification from you. The first issue is that currently he's taking EPO shots, that's iron shots, and he's also taking iron pills and some vitamin B complex but uh, for his uh, low red blood count issue. But I've noticed that that doesn't really seem to be helping him at all. And the second uh, issue is also that 
All this while, he has been on low-sodium diet, low-protein, low-potassium, and low-phosphorus diet. And we have been told to avoid vegetables like spinach, broccoli, green bell pepper, tomatoes, and eggplant. So my question to you is that... Who's telling you all this stuff? Wait a minute, who's telling you all this stuff? Well, we have actually tried different health modalities before, I mean, for the past seven years, so I'm not really sure that... Okay, is your, is your husband on dialysis right now? No, no, he's, the doctor is intending to put him on in the, another two weeks' time, and we are only receiving the products tomorrow. Yeah. So okay. my, 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 pro, my problem is basically is the diet restriction and also in terms of the salt and the protein. Yeah. Well, let's, not, well, let's because, not worry about that. Stop, stop, stop. We, 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 you can salt his food to taste. He needs salt. He can't function without salt. It's all nonsense, okay? Now, um, does he have diabetes? Nope. Okay, just the kidney failure. Yes. Okay. Okay. Now, Shar, what's going on here? Why, why does he have all these problems, and, and particularly kidney flare? The doctor is talking about putting him on dialysis here in a couple of weeks. The odds are he's got a gluten intolerance and he's not absorbing anything. Yeah, that's, that's why he's taking iron and B12 and B vitamins. He's still um, anemic, okay? And Shar is exactly right. The odds are he's not absorbing the nutrients. And so you and he and the dog and the cat and the bird and the fish, children, mother-in-law, renter, grandma, everybody in the household has got to be drop-dead, gluten-free, no wheat, no barley, no oats, no fried foods, no processed meats with nitrates and nitrites, uh, absolutely um, no oils, no microwave popcorn, absolutely no uh, theater popcorn, no, no olive oil, coconut oil, margarine, mayonnaise, celery, cooking oils, and no gluten, no wheat, no barley, no oats. So what would you give this guy? Uh, what, what is... Habib where uh, way? Excuse me. What does Habib wear? Uh, weigh? I keep saying where. One, what does he weigh? One one eight. Yeah, one eighty pounds. Okay. So, Shar, what would you give this guy? One eighty pounds. What would you give him to help the circulation back in his kidneys to support kidney function? Well, I'd give him if he doesn't have anything else wrong. I give him two healthy start packs. But start packs. But I would add, I would add the uh, daily classic daily. And I would add the cardio six, and I would add the uh, niacin plus. Yeah, very good. Now I would be a little heavier handed because this guy's in trouble. So I would give him two healthy brain and heart packs, okay, which I think he, he's receiving today because I think that's what I gave him to order a couple of weeks ago. It'd be two healthy brain and heart packs, and you're exactly right. Uh, he should get the ultimate daily classic, three of those twice a day, two bottles a month. The ultimate cardio six, two of those a day, that's two boxes a month, and the ultimate. Niacin Plus, that's two twice a day, is two bottles a month. And then call us, and he can do his dialysis, but he won't need it very long if he's able to absorb this stuff. We'll be back after these messages. Let's head to New York, and Tara, you're on with Dr. Wallach. Okay, was that Kara? Kara. Okay, how can we help you? Um, I had called you earlier, um, probably about maybe a year ago, um, about some heart issues. I was having a lot of heart palpitations, mm -hmm. and um, so I'm on the BTT 2.0, the OsteoFX, the EFA Plus, um, and I started taking the uh, Plant Drive Minerals, Ocean's Gold, Cell Shield, and CardioFX, Glucogel, Enzymes, mm -hmm. and uh, De-Stress. And um, Prejnatolone. Sounds like you're hitting everything. That's good. <laughs> um, I'm also uh, gluten free, dairy free, oil free, sugar free, all that stuff that you recommend. Mm -hmm. And um, but I'm still having a lot of issues. Um, okay, what does issues mean? Mostly, I'm concerned about. I still have heart palpitations. It's not as bad as it was, mm -hmm. um, but it's. So you've still... seen some. You've seen some detectable improvement, but not all the way. Right. Yeah. Okay. Now um, let me ask you. Let me ask you a question. Mm -hmm. Do you have any history of skin problems? Any eczema, dermatitis, psoriasis, or rosacea? Oh yes. Okay. Eczema. Okay. Now, Char, what would you say? Why she's not getting 100 percent results from us? I mean, she's got a great supplement program. Why is she not getting some benefit here? Because she's not absorbing. Also, I didn't hear her say she was taking selenium, and that's the best thing you can take for your heart. Oh, I'm taking selenium. Oh, okay. Yeah. Good. Yeah. And so, what do you weigh, Kara? Um, 148. 148, okay. And how many of the EFAs are you taking, or EFA pluses? Um, three, three times a day. Okay, that's very good. Now, um, 
Are you working on gluten-free? Oh, I am gluten-free. Okay, what about people in your household? Is everybody else in the house gluten-free? No, because I live with roommates, and I can't. Yeah. Okay, well, there's there's the challenge, okay? There's a challenge, because if you're gluten-free and everybody else in the household is not gluten-free, you're getting cross-contaminated in the laundry, the couch, the beds, the food preparation surfaces, and you may be only 50% gluten-free. Even if you're 100% gluten-free, you're getting cross-contaminated by all your roommates. So there's got to be a major change here, okay? And so you have to think about what's important to you because you're not absorbing everything you're taking in. You're taking in a wonderful program, but your absorption is down. I can't tell without looking at hair analyses and that kind of stuff how much is down, but obviously you're not getting as much um, results as you should have gotten in a year. You've gotten some recognizable result, but you're still concerned, and rightfully so. Well, heart palpitations can be caused by a heart problem, but also what, what's a common cause of atrial fibrillation, Char, heart palpitations? Um, you mean, well, it could be... It could be a blockage. She could have, uh, you know... Uh, yeah, but I'm saying, let's say there's nothing wrong with the heart. Why would she be having palpitations? Because the nerve that's, that goes in through her backbone is being squeezed. Well, yeah, she got degenerative disc disease, back problems. Do you have any back problems, Kaya? Kara? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, there you go. That's so, it right there. Yeah, so that's what's causing your palpitations. This is called atrial fibrillation, and doctors are only too willing to run up $500,000 worth of heart procedures. They'll install pacemakers and defibrillators. They'll do ablations. They'll do retroversions. They'll do heart transplants, and none of those are going to work because it's a back problem. It's not a heart problem. Yeah. So um, you need to work on the gluten-free stuff and, I mean, really, really work on it. You may have to run your washer and dryer um, for a whole load with detergent in it before you put your stuff in there, and you want to clean everything, run everything through the dishwasher and everything before you use plates and stuff, uh, tablecloths and napkins. I would use paper napkins and throw them away, uh, paper towels and things. Don't use other people's towels. you got to have your own towels and uh, don't use theirs. And, you know, all that can be, you got to really be tough. And if you have a dog or cat in the house, you got to read the labels and be gluten-free there. So that's kind of where I would work. You can also take some of the CM cream and have somebody rub the CM cream and the trauma oil on your back in between your shoulder blades from the last seventh cr- uh, cervical uh, vertebrae uh, for the first ten of your um, thoracic vertebrae, you know, uh, T1 through T10, and go ahead and put the CM cream and the trauma oil on it and try and get some of the inflammation off the roots of those um, spinal nerves coming out from between T1 through T4 particularly. And uh, th- this oftentimes will help with the palpitations, but uh, you've obviously got uh, some degenerative disc disease, you've got a back problem, and um, it's causing the palpitations, and so and you have eczema, which is a, a gluten intolerance, so you've got to work on all these fronts, and, and I would just add, again, the CM cream and the trauma oil on your back, and um, make sure you're taking at least 15 glucogel a day to try and get those discs thicker, push the vertebrae apart, take the pressure off and use the CM cream and the trauma oil on your back and lower neck so you can uh, help reduce the swelling around the roots of those nerves. Give us a call in two weeks. Don't wait a year. Okay, uh, Doug, let's go to callers. Let's head to California. And, Ren, you're on with Dr. Wallach. Okay, Ren, you're on the air. Yes, good. Uh, I have two uh, friends, and um, one of them is Patty. She is... Uh, got very severe knee pain and lower back pain. Okay, and let's take one at a time. Okay, so let's okay. take Patty first, knee and back, and how much does she weigh? Uh, 145 pounds. 145 pounds. Okay, what would you do for this lady, Char? I get her on, uh, I'll get her on a, a healthy bone and joint pack and add an extra bottle of glucogel. Okay, and go ahead and throw in an extra bottle of osteo, too. So she has one ounce twice a day of the osteo FX+. Plus. Um, and she needs an extra bottle of glucogel, so she can eat 15 a day, five at breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And I'm saying that so that's one healthy bone and joint pack, as Char says, plus an extra bottle of osteo, extra bottle of, of the um, glucogel. And um, I, I, what would you add to the uh, to the uh, CM cream that comes with the uh, healthy bone and joint pack to make it a deeper pain relief? I'd add the trauma oil. Very good. Yep, four drops per teaspoon on the knees and the hips, the back, the neck, any place she has the pain. She'll get uh, relief within, say, 10, 15 minutes. It'll last three, four, five hours. You have to do it two, three times a day. But after a couple of months, 
if she's absorbing properly, if she has any skin problems or asthma, what would you make sure she avoids? Avoids uh, gluten. All gluten. Oh, exactly. You've got to make sure absorption. Absorption, you know, that, there's an old adage, people say, you are what you eat, and that's absolutely positively not true. You are what you, Char, you are what, you what? You are what you absorb, absorb. Yeah. not what you eat. Exactly. Okay, so give us a call. You see, I guess you have a second question here, Ren. Go ahead. Yes. No, also, this lady has a severe a bladder control problem, and in four weeks' time, she's going to go and they want to freeze her bladder. What can she do? Okay, I would not freeze her bladder. Um, just like this lady before you had palpitations of the heart, was the nerves controlling the heart were being squeezed by degenerative disc disease. She had a back problem. Um, does this friend have lower back problems? She ever go to a chiropractor? Uh, I don't know, but this this lady with the bladder control problem, she has a, a severe lower back and knee problem. Well, there you go, Shar. What's the problem? Problem is the nerves are being squeezed and causing all these problems. Yeah, they have the the nerves controlling the bladder in the lower, lumbar area, the internal branch of the lumbar nerves, the sciatic nerves, uh, are being squeezed. She has uh, lower back problems, and so what would you give her, Shar, for the bladder problem? I'll give her the same thing. A healthy bone and joint pack. Yep, one healthy bone and joint pack for 100 pounds of body weight. I throw in the CM cream and the trauma oil on her lower back, and the bladder problems disappear. It's a back problem, not a bladder problem. And we'll be back after these messages. Back with Dead Doctors Don't Lie on the ZBS Radio Network. Dr. Joel Wallach here for Young Jimmy, 95 Crusade. And Doug, let's go to callers. All right, let's head to Virginia. And Rose, you're on with Dr. Wallach. Well, Rose, you're on the air. How can we help you? Hi, Dr. Wallach. I have a friend whose daughter has Ewing sarcoma. And I was wondering what products to, um, to recommend to her. And okay, then I, I have, have an uncle who has. Okay, so okay, we'll, we'll one at a time here. Okay, uh, tell me again what this child has because I didn't quite get what you said she had. It's called Ewing sarcoma. It's basically, I think it's cancer in the mouth. Sorry, okay, Ewing sarcoma. Okay, how old is this child? Um, she's 12. Okay, any idea how much she weighs? Um, no, I guess around 100 yeah. pounds. Okay, well, the, the thing that we can do for this child, and they have to, you know, decide whether they're going to have surgery and chemotherapy and radiation, all that kind of stuff, that's their decision. But what we can do is add stuff uh, to her diet that's going to support her immune system. And, and when you have cancer of any type, um, the your your own immune system is your best friend, regardless if you choose standard allopathic therapy with it or by itself, or these are decisions the family has to make. We can't direct them to go in any direction because we're not officially their doctor. But um, taking the nutrients certainly will give a better quality of life, can add time, and um, that's all we can say about it because we're going to support the immune system. So, Char, a uh, 12-year-old girl, let's say she weighs 120 pounds. What, what would you do for her if she has uh, a, a cancer in her mouth? Sometimes a Ewing sarcoma is in the chest also. Well, I give her a healthy brain and heart pack, obviously, and then I'd also add some other things to it, like the Ocean's Gold and the um, Pucoid Z and, uh, and, the, okay, very... and the Daily Classic. Not okay. Daily Classic, excuse me, the BTT 2.0 tablet for the, for the Oric Points. Oric Points, yep. Okay, very good. And what would be a fun thing for her to get some Oric Points? The fun thing would be the chocolate, the Triple the Triple chocolate. chocolate, yep. So she could take six of the triple treat chocolate a day, which would be 100,000 auric points. She could take two of the um, Beyond Tangerine 2.0 tablets at breakfast and dinner. That'll be 160,000 auric points a day. She could do it all. I try to do about 400,000 auric points a day to prevent cancer, and so she's got it now, so she has to get as much auric points in to support her immune system. And Char's exactly right. You want to give her the biggest bang for her buck and also her effort, 
And so um, at 12 years old, I give her one a healthy brain and heart pack per month. She can cut it in half, take a half a dose of everything at breakfast and dinner. Also, the Ocean's Gold, as Char said, that's for the sea cucumber that's in there. I'd have her take three tablets twice a day. Uh, that's two bottles a month. And also the Fucoid Z, if she prefers capsules, um, she could take uh, two or three of those twice a month. That's two bottles a month that has the Fucoid in it, which is legendary for reducing cancer uh, in the Japanese population. And then if she prefers liquid, she could take... What would you take as a liquid source of fucoid, Char? Uh, the Z-radical. Z-radical, very good, yep. And she could take an ounce of that twice a day if she wanted, or a half ounce twice a day, which was ever comfortable for her. And this is going to support her immune system. And then she's got to avoid all the bad foods. So what foods, what bad foods should she avoid, Char? All fried foods, no oils, no olive oil, no salad oil, no margarine, no burnt animal fat, none of that. Yep, and no processed meats. Perfect. Very, very well said. And, you know, please let us know how this child is doing. Um, we deal with a lot of families that have children with cancers. And we, we need, again, we don't want to be burying our children, so we need to be doing all the good things and avoiding all the bad things before these kids get sick is the, is the way to save a lot of effort, to save a lot of unnecessary misery and pain and money and early death. We've got to give these kids all 90 essential nutrients. Even a food chemistry journal came out. Uh, April 16th, 2012, looked at the top um, baby formulas in America, you know, things like uh, Infamil, Similac, Gerber's, uh, Carnation, found that they contain less than 20% of all the minerals and vitamins that babies need to develop. Contain less than 20%. Dog food has 100% for goodness sakes. Well, thank you, Char. Super job as usual. Thank you so much, Doug and Richard. Superlative job as usual. God bless each and every one of you. God bless our troops. God bless our Navy SEALs. And God bless America. Hi everyone, Andy Anderson here. Are you using those handy little bottles of gel that zap germs, bacteria, and other nasties? In today's world, that's smart, especially with all the filthy doorknobs, shopping carts, and handrails we touch every day. Here's what you may not know. Once the alcohol evaporates, goodbye effectiveness. No more protection until you use it again. Pure works to the rescue. Our FDA-compliant foam, lotion, soap, and spray do not rely on alcohol. Their killing power lasts up to four hours. Pure Work Disinfecting Spray is EPA certified to kill swine flu, bird flu, MRSA, HIV, hepatitis B and C, and a whole host of viruses and bacteria, mold and fungus too. It's even safe around children and pets. You'll love the soft feel of Pure Works on your hand. It actually conditions that will not dry your skin. Here's a little peace of mind knowing your hands are still germ-free hours later. Get your hands on Pure Works and get Pure Works on your hands. Stand by. Pull out your paper and pencil for your local number to order Pure Works. Your knees, elbows, hands, shoulders, and back crop up. Reach for Longevity's CM Cream. Put CM Cream on a Q-tip and put it in your ear canal for relief from headaches and sinus pressure. A topical temporary relief from minor aches and pains of muscles and joints associated with arthritis, strains, sprains, and simple back aches. Why take aspirin or non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs that can cause stomach bleeding and liver damage? Just apply CM Cream liberally to the affected areas, and within 20 minutes or so, you'll have relief from those nagging minor aches and pains. You'll feel better for up to four to five hours. So the next time you have achy joints or muscles, do what I do. Reach for CM Cream for relief. And for systemic relief, reach for CM Plus capsules. If you'd like to learn more about nutritional supplementation, call your local Longevity associate, and don't forget to ask about home-based business opportunities. If you've been diagnosed with type 2 diabetes, prediabetes, or the metabolic syndrome, and you're tired of seeing your blood glucose levels rise and fall like a ship on the ocean, but you don't want to take those drugs the rest of your life, Longevity has an alternative. A product called Sweeties has been developed just for you. Used as part of your regular diet, Sweeties helps maintain healthy blood sugar levels, a formulation specially designed to nutritionally assist your body with the regulation of your blood sugar level. Sweeties supports healthy glucose metabolism because it's fortified with aspartic acid, chromium, and vanadium, all to help you promote healthy blood sugar levels. If you want to get off those drugs and control your blood sugar metabolism naturally, try Longevity's Sweeties product. If you'd like to learn more about nutritional supplementation, call your local Longevity associate. And don't forget to ask about home-based business opportunities. 
You've listened to physician and veterinarian Dr. Joel Wallach help many people on the Dead Doctors Don't Lie talk radio program. You've also heard hundreds of people tell how Dr. Wallach and Longevity products have changed their lives. If you're now convinced that Dr. Wallach is onto something and you want to try Longevity's premium quality products for yourself, we can connect you with a distributor that serves your local area. Simply call our special helpline voicemail at 313-444-3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call right now and leave your name, telephone number, or email address, and we'll see to it that the right person contacts you shortly. Remember, the phone number, 313-444-3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call now to change your life. That's 313-444-3463. You've listened to physician and veterinarian Dr. Joel Wallach help many people on the Dead Doctors Don't Lie talk radio program. You've also heard hundreds of people tell how Dr. Wallach and Longevity products have changed their lives. If you're now convinced that Dr. Wallach is onto something and you want to try Longevity's premium quality products for yourself, we can connect you with a distributor that serves your local area. Simply call our special helpline voicemail at 313-444-3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call right now and leave your name, telephone number, or email address, and we'll see to it that the right person contacts you shortly. Remember, the phone number, 313-444-3463. That's 313 313- 444-3463. Call now to change your life. That's 313-444-3463. I am Judy DeVilbus. Here I am speaking to you again. I just wanted to tell you that recently I started drinking the whey shakes again, the chocolate whey shake. And you need to remember the whey shake isn't just for losing weight. It's a fantastic place to get your great protein And if you're trying to gain weight, you can take it along with your meals. And the best part is, if you want to just have a great protein shake, do like I do. Put it over ice, stir it up, and you can sip on it for 20 minutes to an hour. I do it every single day. I absolutely love it. You need to get back to it, too. It's really good for you. And it makes not fat, but it makes muscle after you work out. And you can also mix it up in a blender with an egg, and you have the most incredible health protein shake Or mix it with a little water, stir it up, and you have a little pudding. And who doesn't like pudding? For more information or to order, call your Longevity distributor today. And don't forget to ask about Longevity home-based business opportunities. You've listened to physician and veterinarian Dr. Joel Wallach help many people on the Dead Doctors Don't Lie talk radio program. You've also heard hundreds of people tell how Dr. Wallach and Longevity products have changed their lives. If you're now convinced that Dr. Wallach is onto something and you want to try Longevity's premium quality products for yourself, we can connect you with a distributor that serves your local area. Simply call our special helpline voicemail at 313-444-3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call right now and leave your name, telephone number, or email address, and we'll see to it that the right person contacts you shortly. Remember, the phone number, 313-444-3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call now to change your life. That's 313-444-3463. Hi, this is Dr. Joel Wallach, your host of Dead Doctors Don't Lie. If you're interested in a colon cleanse, blood cleanse, liver cleanse, you know, in the classical herbal way, you want to ask your longevity associate for herbal rainforest. Herbal rainforest has 16 herbs, 16 cleansing herbs, classic cleansing herbs, and 77 plant minerals. That's right, and these are all organic. It doesn't get any better than that. In your busy day, and you're around all these toxins out there in your workplace, on the way home, going to work, in your food, in the air, in the water, you need herbal rainforest. I guarantee you, it will give you a cleanse. You can control the dose. It's a liquid. It tastes good. It doesn't get any better than this. A colon that's happy makes you happy. Nothing better than a happy colon. Herbal rainforest. Clean it out. For more information on this product or others you've heard about on the Dead Doctors Don't Lie radio program, call your local Longevity associate today. And don't forget to ask about home-based business opportunities. 
Greetings, everyone. Judy DeVilbus here. What do you think of when you hear the words tangy tangerine? Well, I think of like a sweet tangy tasting something. Well, what I'm referring to is the ultimate tangy tangerine. It's a fantastic product. It has everything you need and a great benefit is it's very, very delicious. It's very easy to drink. I've suggested it even to youngsters. Even children like it. Even little guys. Even little girls. They come right into my office. Their parents can't get them to take those chewable and besides that, they're not as good as tangy tangerine. And I give them a little taste of that and you know something, they're pleased as punch. So if it's good for a child and it tastes delicious, why not you? There's no excuse not to take a vitamin when it tastes as good as that does. So how about it? Tangy tangerine should be the answer to all of your nutritional program problems. For more information or to order, call your Longevity distributor today. And don't forget to ask about Longevity home-based business opportunities. Fish has been thought of as a brain food for eons, but it's not the fish that's key. It's actually the essential fatty acids, EFAs, or omega-3s found in fish, called essential because they're necessary for good health and your body can't make them. So they must be consumed through diet or supplementation. Longevity has developed the perfect supplement in SmartFX, an acronym for Sustained Memory and Retrieval Time, a concentration of DHA and EPA both members of the omega-3 family, supporting neural path function and cardiovascular health for optimal mental concentration, awareness, focus, and agility. If you've got a mentally demanding career, you're a student crunching for the big test, or just want to maintain health for a sense of well-being, try SmartFX from Longevity. If you'd like to learn more about nutritional supplementation, call your local Longevity associate, and don't forget to ask about home-based business opportunities. Through his research as a veterinarian, Dr. Joel Wallach discovered that most health problems afflicting livestock can be prevented and even reversed. Many of these same health challenges also occur in humans. These too can be prevented and reversed. Doc's original formula called the pig arthritis formula alleviated all arthritis symptoms in animals. The same basic formula has been developed for humans called the pig pack which includes plant-derived minerals, a multiple vitamin complex, glucogel, and EFAs. Add to that Longevity's Osteo FX Plus, a proprietary blend of liquid calcium, magnesium, and glucosamine. Now you have the Pig Pack Plus to make up the 90 essential nutrients Dr. Wallach has identified as necessary for sustained good health and longevity. If you'd like to learn more about nutritional supplementation, call your local Longevity associate. And don't forget to ask about home-based business opportunities. You've listened to physician and veterinarian Dr. Joel Wallach help many people on the Dead Doctors Don't Lie talk radio program. You've also heard hundreds of people tell how Dr. Wallach and Longevity products have changed their lives. If you're now convinced that Dr. Wallach is onto something and you want to try Longevity's premium quality products for yourself, we can connect you with a distributor that serves your local area. Simply call our special helpline voicemail at 313-444-3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call right now and leave your name, telephone number, or email address, and we'll see to it that the right person contacts you shortly. Remember, the phone number, 313-444-3463. That's 313-444-3463. Call now to change your life. That's 313-444-3463. If you're the type of person who likes to volunteer and help others, this should interest you. What better way to help people than to help them overcome their health challenges? Longevity has been helping people overcome their health challenges for years. Our approach to health is drastically different than medical doctors who mostly only treat symptoms. As a veterinarian, Dr. Joel Wallach discovered that many common disease states are actually preventable and reversible. Our mission at Longevity is to educate Americans about their own health. If you like helping people, join us in our fight to save America. While you're helping people prevent and overcome health challenges, you will also be able to build a lucrative home-based business. So what are you waiting for? Come join us and help save America. If you've decided to join us, call your local Longevity associate to find out how you can arm yourself with the knowledge that's needed to save America.
Numerous studies have shown the link between the intake of antioxidants and disease prevention. Foods and supplements are measured in an auric scale. Auric is an acronym for Oxygen Radical Absorption Capacity. In other words, the ability to remove disease causing free radicals from the human body. Longevity Cell Shield RTQ has an auric value of 15,800 points per serving. Cell Shield RTQ contains resveratrol, known as an anti aging compound, turmeric, known for promoting healthy digestion, brain function, immune system, and cellular longevity. Quercetin, a flavonoid, is known for promoting healthy blood sugar metabolism and healthy lung and cardiovascular function. Remove free radicals from your body with Cell Shield RTQ from Longevity. If you'd like to learn more about nutritional supplementation, call your local Longevity associate. And don't forget to ask about home-based business opportunities.